Many people obtain complete relief from their chronic migraine headaches just by engaging in the undoctored basic wild naked unwashed program. In particular, wheat and grain elimination can provide complete relief or partial relief from migraine headaches in a lot of people. But there's an occasional person who does everything right in the uh, basic program but still may be left with at least some headaches. Uh, maybe less in frequency, less duration, or less severe, but still have the headaches. What can you do in that situation? Well, there are additional steps you can take. This is all detailed in the undoctored advanced concepts for preventing migraine headaches. Among the strategies we talk about there is using magnesium a little differently. So magnesium, we're all deficient in magnesium at the start of your program. And that's why we advocate everybody taking a magnesium supplement. But magnesium is restored over years. If you start a magnesium supplement on Monday, you're not restored by Wednesday. It takes years to restore tissue magnesium, including sufficient magnesium to modulate the vasospasm, the, the vessel spasm, that is part of the cause of migraine headaches. So I urge you to use the magnesium water recipe because that's the best we have. That simple recipe yields magnesium bicarbonate that is by far the most absorbable form of magnesium and raises magnesium tissue levels faster. Even that slow. It's not as fast as, say, intravenous magnesium that I used to give people in the hospital when they had life-threatening heart rhythms because that works within minutes uh, very rapidly. Megadose magnesium within minutes. But we can't do that, of course, at home on your own. So we go to the next best which is magnesium water, far better than the tablet or capsule forms of magnesium. But you build a dose up over time, and this alone is a very big advantage. Another strategy to consider is to have your homocysteine levels drawn, because the higher your homocysteine, the more likely it is it's a part of the list of causes of your uh, migraine headaches, especially if you have a gene called MTHFR, C677T. That specific gene that impairs your capacity to absorb folates or folic acid and B12 to some degree can amplify your potential for migraine headaches. So we talk about how to address that issue and how to correct it, which uh, those strategies alone uh, also provide a lot of people with relief from migraine headaches. There are what I call mitochondrial strategies. It's clear that many people with migraine headaches have a genetic variant in their mitochondria. The energy produce little components within all your body's cells. And some people respond very well to nutrients like riboflavin and coenzyme Q10 because those are both involved in mitochondrial energy generation. And there are some other strategies to consider, but those that's the basic menu of items to consider if you have migraine headaches that persist, even though you've done all the basic uh, uh, components of the undoctored wild naked unwashed program.